They were being written off a wee bit. We knew it was going to be a one point game as I got all along. Halfway through the second half, it, it didn't look great. You know, we were four down and, and uh, with, with a, you know, with a, with a knock -hill battle. But first of the boys showed, showed great, great character, they were experienced total as well, and just delighted to get over the line. Indeed, and you did say that coming up to the game that there was only going to be a kick of the ball between them since that draw was made. Exactly how it turned out, but you would have tucked up, as you said, with four points down and 15 minutes to go or so. Well, there's no doubt, you know, and I suppose it was a tricky sort of a, a tricky game, and the, the, the wind, you know, in the first half, we were against the wind, and we found it hard to. to you know, get scores particularly, and uh, I suppose we weren't in a bad position half time, but we knew overall that we still had to raise our game. And, and first, the captain came out very strong in the second half as well. So, but it, it just, I think, just as, as a half we're on, I think we just, we just overall, we just did, uh, you know, collectively and individually, we lifted our game, we started to get a grip around the middle of the field, uh, use the ball better, and, and we're able to get the, the scores, the vital scores. I come back on the first half, Malachi. In fairness, Calvin probably deserved that slender advantage at half time, you know, maybe that slightly better side in the first half. Yeah, that's probably that's probably right. Uh, I thought we, we started off poorly and that you know, they were getting a little bit of space inside and so on. Um, uh, we, you know, we had plenty of the ball and we made the wrong decisions at times. We ran into trouble at times and, and uh, got overturned and bits and pieces like that. So it was a case of, of in, the, in the second half end of, of just trying to. Uh, just be cuter on the ball, use it better. And, uh, but we, we, we just knew we, we needed up our rope and our urgency and everything. Second half, and I think as, 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 as the half went on, we did that. And, uh, and again, as well as the experienced fellas coming in as well, made, made, made a big difference. Yeah, that was an event you were fit to call Colin Walsh's first appearance of 2015, so it's great to have Colin back. You also took on Dick Clark in there, and Christopher McGuinness is back too, so it's fantastic for you to have so many players available again. That's right, you know, and, and we had made a number of injuries over this last few weeks coming into the, this game, uh, that you know it was always going to be hard to, to contend with. Um, so no, we'd like to get them fellas in, as you say, Colin to come in there and get through the game. Uh, there's a number of other fellas there who who have had injuries and just clearing up and so on. So picked up a couple there today as well with Drew and, and Kieran. And so we're just hoping that, that you know we'll assess them will be okay and that uh, we'll have a clean bit of health now going forward because. Probably the last couple of weeks, last week or so, I know the panel has been as strong as I've been all year, so hopefully we will continue with that. You mentioned here Hughes there, we've seen him going off at half time and maybe the second half, but they're obviously done wonders on him at half time. Aye, well, there was, there was that, that doubt, you know, and, and uh, we considered taking him off, um, and then in 10 minutes, second half, we considered the same thing. We just felt that he was still he was still being effective out there and he was still you know he was getting his hands a lot of ball, he was causing them bother, he was you know, he's a big option for us round in the middle of the field as well. So we just took the chance of, of leaving him there and, and hopefully you know it hasn't done any any damage that'll that will take a long time to repair. If there's any final as we said now, you'll be an interested spectator next week in Bristol Park for Anna and Antrim, so you're there so you'll enjoy next week's game to see who you're gonna be up against. Yeah, that's exactly it, you know what uh, you know We'll be going in probably next year's favourites again, but it doesn't mean anything. And, and you know, from our to whoever comes through, we'll be mad keen to get to the most final. It's, it's a brilliant chance for them as well. So, you know, we, we just have to get our heads down again now and, and focus on, on whoever it is we're playing and, and, and try to you know, get a big performance. That's, that's all we can do. And if we get a, a, as good a performance as we possibly can, then we'll give ourselves a great chance. Great stuff, well done, Alec. Thank you.